the first question we'll ask today is why should you listen to me now the answer to that question is last 17 years i have produced more than one lakh life science postgraduates and PhDs who successfully qualified CSI net and now they are working in various labs. You name it, you walk into any lab in India or abroad. If there is an Indian, he would be subscribed to Biotechnica's either CSI net or uh, regular subscriber updates. That is the kind of reach and that is the kind of help we have provided to the biosciences community in the last 17 years. Now today, as you are watching this video, I am talking to you after after talking to several geniuses who have qualified CSI net for multiple times with top ranks. So what I did is I combined all of that into one video so that I can share with you. Now, first things first, it's very, very important for you to, you to know that success does not come in one day. Okay, success does not come in by watching one video, but you will have to make notes as I speak so that it is easier for you to succeed in the future because I believe that if every biotechnician succeeds, then only my life is worth. So let's get started with the first point. As soon as you look at the syllabus of CSI net, you realize that it is 14 different units, 13 units plus part eights, like 14 different master syllabus combined together. Right now, if you're a zoology, botany will be weak. You, if you're a cell biologist, your uh, ecology will be weak. Something like that will always be there. So it is very important to know the syllabus. And it is very important to know which part of the syllabus is important, which part you can skip. And that is where Biotechnica has cre cre created a massive data database of things which you can download for free so that you can know which part of the syllabus is important and which part is not important. Right. Let's look at the second part. The second thing is once you know the syllabus, then you have to look for the reference material. Most of the geniuses don't disclose it because this is something which is secret. Right. And the secret is they will go for the biotechnicas, either coaching or study material or test series or a combination of all. Now, biotechnica started with live classes and then in last 17 years we have developed multiple books, multiple revision tools, mul multiple ways of studying and that helps students qualify. So the reference material which is available in Biotechnica is so in-depth that after that you probably don't need anything else. So that's the second secret. If you are also looking for study material, you can always click on the link in the description and you can find that out for yourself. The third one which we have is creating the study plan. Now, if you want to create a study plan, it is very, very important to know what part of the day you are most active. And then accordingly, you design your day. So if you do design your day, then only you can succeed in your day. Right. And every day is a small drop in the ocean called preparation. And then finally, it will lead you to the destination. So you have to create a study plan very, very carefully. Now, the fourth point is conceptual understanding. If you are not understanding the concepts in such a way that you don't need to memorize them, then it is of waste. So you have to remember it in such a way that if no matter I wake you up at two o'clock and say that, okay, tell me what is Michael's mental equation and how do you derive it? You can derive it and you can tell me. That is the kind of conceptual clarity is required for CSI in it. The next point is practical application because part C is all about practice all about uh, how things are done in lab and that data, that kind of questions will come. It will be huge questions, right? Uh, by the time you finish half of the question, you will, you will, you will uh, you know, collapse. So it's very important to have the practical application part understanding and data analysis and mathematical understanding of the questions. Very, very important. Then comes the revision. Toppers always revise periodically, not at the end. If you ask me, I will give you a revision rule, which is revise every day, practice every day. Divide your day into three parts, self-study, revision and practice. And now when you are self-studying, you'll get doubts and that is where Biotechnica's teachers and coaching will come to your help and rescue and that is where you have to go through. So yeah, you have to revise every day. Now stay up to date always look at the recent research papers, create a habit of reading research papers because sometimes questions will be coming from the research papers also. Discussion groups you can join, Biotechnica has discussion group where you can join. Then also you have to make sure that you continuously for the next six months, your health should be proper. Suppose you fall sick or anybody in your family falls sick, then your preparation will be impacted. I know a girl very talented, but her father was sick and so she could not focus on her preparation and she got, you know, less marks in CSI. Instead, you have to make sure that you and your family is well taken care of while you are preparing. So that is very, very important. 
Next point will be time management. Now, time management is of two types. Whether you do time management during your preparation properly and the second will be time management during the exam. So, you have to take a lot of mock exams such as AIMNET exam which Biotechnica conducts so that you are completely ready for the uh, ex exam day. Okay. Now, the next will be expert guidance. Now, I can learn, make mistakes and learn from it or I can learn from 100 people's mistake which is better. I'll save time if I learn from 100 people's mistake. That's what experts do. Experts guide 100 people. They know what kind of mistakes you'll make and they'll warn you. You save time. And that is what Biotechnica gives you with, with our regular coaching. Next batch is starting in January. That will be the Arjuna batch. You can join there. Now, next will be uh, analytical skills, mathematical skills, development, and that is where general aptitude comes into picture. picture. You have to develop good skills for general aptitude, uh, probability, all this. And if you're writing for gate, of, of course, engineering mathematics also comes into picture. So developing analytical skills helps you solve more questions and faster, right? Speed maths is also something. Now, regular self-evaluation, taking tests and checking how you are doing. It's very important. That is where Biotechnica has a tough net question bank. You can get it as a part of the fire scholarship and then you can get it for free also and you can self-evaluate. The last and very important thing is staying positive and self-motivated. You see, if I am not motivated, I would not have, you know, made this video, right? The same way, if you are not motivated, you will not feel like studying. And if you don't feel like studying, even though you have the best books in front of you, you will not study, right? These are the 15 points which I wanted to highlight today in today's video. Remember, geniuses are not born, they are made and they are made at Biotechnica. So if you want to become a genius in CSI and you want to qualify, you want to work in top-notch labs like AIMS, IAC or NCBS or th something like that, then you are at the right place. You can join Biotechnica's FIRE scholarship, which is Franklin International Research Excellence Scholarship, where you get exposure to all of this, plus a lot of other things. So you can check that out at fire.biotechnica.org. And if you are check, you know, seeing this video a little later when this scholarship has closed, you can always dial us on 1-800-1200-1818 and find out what best we can do for you. You can write to me at shaker at biotechnica.org and I wish you all the best in your preparation for CSI and remember on YouTube you'll find hundreds and thousands of videos but they will just waste your time. If you want to save time, join Biotechnica. Take care. Bye-bye.